Fox plays it's hard out. to be against aggressive against Armada though. It's super hard, especially. Oh, whoa! Clean, All right. clean, clean. Only 64% on Ryan Ford. Well, those who don't know, Ryan Ford has actually taken a setup and beat the King in the past too. So he's definitely had like his God Slayer status at one point in time. Yeah. He was he wasn't active for a bit. Um, for about a year. Yeah, for about a year, and then he came back and uh, and he's he's uh, he's definitely killing it. Competing for top eight right here against Armada. Nice shield grab. I actually hate shield grabs. I hate shield grabs in the passion. But like, it, I I I like when people make you have a bad aerial. They purposely run up to you and shield in a good way for them. That makes you have a bad aerial that's punishable by grab. I think that's respectable. Well, yeah, that's part of the game, dude. I know. Yeah. I think that I'm saying sorry. Amazing. I think that's amazing. Not respectable. That's a doing what it takes to win is respectable. In its own right. But I think like taking it the extra mile is even more respectable. Ooh. <laughs> that was cheating. Shine with intended purpose. Whenever that happens, you have to say it. You have to say that's what his intended purpose is. Yeah. Alright. This did start off really good for Ryan. Um, he is down to stock now, but kill percent on Armada. Oh my god, the patient forward air just gets him. Down throw touch chase. Shield grab from Armada. Puts him off stage, but not, he doesn't get anything from it. Shield is looking small. Yeah, I think if Ryan just puts on a little more pressure, um, the the option of shield uh, becomes slowly, slowly diminishes for Armada. You gotta do that new tech. You gotta do that crutch, uh, that SDI in tech shine uh, on Peach's upbeat. What? Have you seen? You haven't seen that yet? This guy put out a, a video of uh, all the characters ledge teching, kind of like ledge teching SDIing in on um, Peach's upbeat when she's trying to recover, and then they get a kill move off of it. Oh, that sounds awesome. It's uh, in a lot of anti Peach tech. It's hard to do though. <laughs> Everyone just hates Peach, and they're trying to come up with ways to beat her. I mean, it's not like Peach is like the end-all character, it's just Armada is such an amazing player. Oh, he's so good. Peach is actually so slow, Armada's just so good at using her. Yeah. Definitely makes her look like she's way faster than she is. Same with Nun and, and uh, Captain Falcon. Yeah, same, and then West Balls with Falco. Falco's, not, Falco's actually slow. Then you see West Balls and Mango move really fast sometimes. Oh no, the chain grabs right now. Yeah. Armada not new to this. Yeah, that's, that's kind of one of the downsides. Uh, like I mentioned earlier about this, when the platforms go away, for Fox, for Falco, for Captain Falcon, when you're playing against Peach, the, the chain grab just becomes an option. And you know, if you happen to be caught on stage while the platform's not there, you, as soon as you get caught in chain grab. Alright, so game two goes to Battlefield. And it seems that Ryan Ford has switched to Sheik. Uh, I don't agree. Maybe he's just trying to. I don't know. I don't know what he's trying to do. I've, se I've seen him do this before, but I'm he's known to switch characters a lot. Yeah. But uh, I don't agree with this simply because Armada's brother, for one, and I think he's. Be I think. I think Armada is better at the Sheik matchup than he is at the Fox matchup. You think so? I think so. He doesn't lose against Sheik. He loses to Foxes. Uh, but that's also a player as opposed to character. But it's also it's also true. Yeah. He doesn't lose to sheep players. I guess what, like the main argument against against this is that he, his brother Android plays play sheep. Play sheep. They team together. He knows yeah. the character. He knows what to do. He also has a, he also has a pocket sheep. Armada, Armada, Armada? Armada has played sheep before. Not oh, okay. in in crew battle, but like not. But he but his sheep is good. Damn. Okay, I didn't know that. Uh, Summit, okay. I believe. Crew battles it's, uh, Iron Man's at Summit. Oh, true. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, not not crew battle. Iron Man. I feel like every top player probably has a decent sheik, just because they're a top player. De pocket Fox, Pocket Sheik, yeah. uh, Pocket Low Tier. <laughs> every top player has a Pocket Low Tier. That's like Mango Mario, AR, Amada Game and Watch, Hbox Ness, yeah, Pizza King, Pichu, <laughs> PBMD, also Mario, I think. Yeah, PBMD has Mario, I think. West Balls DK. Yeah, West Balls DK is actually amazing. I mean, but unfortunately, West Balls DK is going to do this match. I just want to talk about it. Ugh. Yeah, I mean, this is just 
it's 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 a spacing game right it's now. A, it's yeah, it's a spacing that's, game. That's basically what. All right, doesn't get as much. That's good. It it feels like Ryan Ford is in is in like a bigger deficit than he is, but the stocks are tied and sixty percent is seven day now. Eighty three. Eighty three. Uh, nice. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's, slow, it's slowly getting worse, but yeah, yeah. And counter's okay. still going up, and that's it. Yeah. Well, ten seconds ago he wasn't doing that bad, but now he's doing it worse. Him. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm afraid I don't agree with the the chic from Ryan Ford. I don't. I, don't agree I mean, I'll be honest though. He's the one playing against Armada for top eight, not me. So he's. I mean, I'll, well, he, he can do. He no, wants, he did this. He did this against none. It was game. It went to game five, and then he went cheap. And he got wrecked. And he lost. And he lost. Oh. Yeah. I think I. I'm not. I'm not discrediting him in any way. I do think he should just stick to his guns, regardless. One. One other times you're gonna get to play Armada. You might as well learn the matchup with the Fox. That's the way I see it. That's true. But he, yeah. he, it's also. It's also he's doing what he wants to do, and I cannot discredit him for that. So. Yeah. Yeah, at the end of the day, Ryan Ford can do whatever he wants, and if he loses, then that'll just be his own lesson learned. That's his talk, right? Yeah, that's good. He's still keeping it respectable. Yeah, I mean, that's what I said last talk, and then he immediately died. Same percent, too. Yeah. Yep. Oh, God. <laughs> so let's just not, <laughs> no, let's just not talk. Let's just it. not talk. We're <laughs> ruining Ryan Ford's game. Let's just not game. talk. Let's just, just no. Again. No. <laughs> yeah, that's interesting. <laughs> Why is he? <laughs> See, he's also wearing a tag with cheek, which I don't agree with. That's true. That's that's a uh, quote-unquote taboo for Sheik, isn't it? And Mewtwo. And Mewtwo, yeah. Anyone with a teleportation recovery, except Pikachu. It's pretty pretty volatile. You can just react. Yeah. All right. Wow, that was an amazing setup. Goes for another up air. Okay, Armada, relax. Relax, Armada. It's not even top 88. Calm down. You can, uh... Oh, she'll DI in to get the grab. Yeah, that was like amazing space for Armada, and he just, I think he just messed up his pressure a little bit. Got a shield grab. That's unfortunate for Ryan Ford. Uh, that will do it. Right, uh... So Ryan going into losers, Armada going into top 8, winner's side. Zoo is going to be hopping on now. Um, it's going to be losers. Against who? I do not know. I don't have the bracket in front of me. Or do you know who Zoo is playing against? <laughs> Thanks for tuning in, guys, though. Welcome to Canada Cup. If you're just joining us today, 